Thank you. The concrete structure on the outside. Very good. Standing by. So this broke out at 540. It's only been burning for, wow, 20 minutes. Boy, they certainly can. We're in the Long Beach Signal Hill area. Technically, it's Signal Hill. It's a one-story commercial structure. Parts Plus is a business in the front right off of, I'll show you in SkyMap 7, 28th Street. Um, and it won't affect the, too much of your commute. You can see it from the 405, as you mentioned. There is some concern here. Now, we believe it's not just Parts Plus, but a couple other businesses uh, on what would be the north side, the top of your screen. And it looks like that uh, wall is going to buckle here in a moment. They're trying to get the hook and ladders up, get as much water on this as possible, fight it defensively. That's all they can do. We're really concerned about it spreading to that structure to the left, which would be to the west. And if it goes towards the north, there are tankers up there filled with fuel of some type. You see some cars in the back, but you also see up there they're moving around some chemicals, some fuel. So there's always a concern about that. Certainly it looks like to be able to stop this fire from spreading, uh, but it's only been burning now for about 20 minutes. It gives you an idea how quickly this fire exploded. Um, we do uh, have a situation where there's little to no wind right now. We'll show you a wide shot. We talked about that smoke. It's going straight up into the air. Fortunately, it's not laying down on the community here. That's important because we don't know what's burning. We don't know what's inside that structure for the most part. Uh, and what they manufacture, what type of chemicals could be in there, that sort of thing. Uh, the smoke could be toxic. But right now, they're doing everything they can do just to get as much water on this as possible to try and put this fire out. It's going to be difficult, though. Looks like there's a lot of fuel in there. It is a very large fire, a tough one to contain. And uh, right now, they're just taking a defensive stance, trying to make sure it doesn't spread to any other structure in this area. Uh, that's correct. For the most part, you've got to go, you know, maybe uh, 10 blocks in either direction, maybe even a little bit more, uh, before you get towards any homes. It's really an industrial area south of the 405 freeway, not far from Long Beach Freeway. Everybody on the 405 will see it. There's no doubt about that. Uh, but it's not affecting the freeway as of yet. But no homes close to it, so that's good news. All right. Oh, it's still like burning. 
This is not the extreme end of it. What do you call that wall? There's a wall there, obviously. Not a uh, firewall. Looks like it's probably not going to spread past that. Slide a little bit to the north and to the uh, east, would you? I mean, maybe we can see what those other businesses are in there, if there's signs. Right here's good. Lightopia. Say again? Oh my goodness, yeah, <laughs> restoration company. They won't to go far. Settling.
What do you call those strips? All right, this is a tease that I'm doing. All right. Okay. All right. And we are following a large commercial structure fire in Signal Hill, right in the Long Beach area. It looks a little encouraging right now compared to what we saw earlier, but still, uh, they're battling this. We don't, have not heard of a knockdown yet. Please stay with us. We'll be right back with a complete update. Can you uh, re-rack some of that uh, better footage for me? Okay. All right, copy. So. Hey, man, how'd that happen? Did you step on it or just go out of nowhere? <laughs> Let there be light.
All right, copy, standing by. All right. Great, great. I'll talk a little bit about the firewall. Credit to new construction. It didn't spread the trench cut surrounding area and then probably wrap it up. We're going to play our own video. We have video of when we first got here. Is that you on the doubler? Or are we just off on the sky map? Yeah, Rachel Boy, things look great compared to what it looked like when we first got here. Uh, we'll show you some video in just a moment. Parts Plus is the structure, or the business, I should say, in the front of this structure. And it's credit to the firewall. It hit the firewall. The backside of this building is a company called Lightopia. It got to that point and pretty much stopped. You see the trench cut there on top of your screen, LA County Firefighters, just making sure a smoke and, does, and heat doesn't spread across the attic and start another fire. But look at that. All of a sudden, it just flared up. We did get a report that there's some acetylene tanks possibly inside this structure and for firefighters to take it easy but they've really surrounded it pretty quickly uh, we've only had this fire working for about 45 minutes or so and they really did a great job here's the footage of when we first got on scene and boy this fire just erupted it was intense it looked like it was going to take out this entire structure but a good job by firefighters really stopped it we'll come back out to a live shot no reported injuries we don't know how the fire started certainly encouraging though it looks like they're going to get a knockdown here sometime soon leslie rachel Uh, absolutely. You can. How far out are we? Are we done with the fire? Let's go to the 405710 and we'll shoot it south and I can talk about the fire a little bit. So go up north of the north and west of the 405710. Give me a smelly hotel. Smells like skunk. All right, we'll shoot looking south, and uh, yeah, you could back off a little more, maybe just a little bit more, so we can get the fire in there. It'd be a little easier. Okay, you can hold it right here and point it to the. East. It will be. Mike, give me the north. I want to look right down that freeway there.
Uh, so I'll end up talking about that fire. You can open up, talk about the four or five looks great, you know, um, and then we'll just sort of zoom into the fire real quick. They're doing a great job knocking that down. That's good news. No reported injuries. And then pull out and show the four or five again. Wide shot. There you go. Beautiful. All right. Well, I've got John, Rachel, and Leslie, but that's okay. <laughs> uh, no, no, I wasn't told. I just write it down. No, no, uh, no worries. Nah, exactly. I switch them. I switch them around every time because I hate saying the same thing every time. Boy, that's red. Uh, you know, not too bad, actually. Very well on the 405 and the 710 in the Long Beach area. Look at that. Now, that's the 405 north coming at us, going over the 710, north and southbound 710. looks great. If you were with us earlier, we had a pretty big structure fire right off of 17th Street in the Signal Hill area. But, boy, uh, County Fire knocked it down quickly. That was a barn burner. It really got on that quick. That won't affect your drive. Only a couple streets shut down, really, in that industrial area. But the 405 looks great. For a time there, everybody could see that big plume of black smoke. But they're knocking it down. And the drive through here really is moving fairly well. John, Rachel, Leslie? We can go uh, pick up the 110 North. We'll see if that Imperial Highway thing she was talking about, which is right by the 105, is a big deal. 